Hey, how is it going, everybody? So, question of the day. How much storage are you going to need on your iPhone 16 Pro? We're hearing lots of stories regarding the AI and the different things that are going to be going on and the different updates. And as we all know, over time, our phones have gone from 32 gigabytes, 64 gigabytes, 128 gigabytes, 256 gigs, all the way up to one terabyte. Now, say you're using like an iPhone 15, an iPhone 14, and you know you're going to upgrade to the iPhone 16 Pro or an iPhone 16. How much space are you going to need? Now, the easiest way to judge that is this. Come over here to your settings. Come down here to general. Come over here to iPhone storage. And this will give you a good gauge of what you currently have going on. Now, back in the day, I could easily get away with 128 gigabytes. I'm a video creator, so I use a little more. And we'll come right here and I'll show you what I have going on here. So you can see in my photos, I have 37 gigs. iMessage, I have 18 gigabytes. I could probably like shrink these. I leave videos on my phone for a little while just in case something needs to get edited or if a, if a YouTube video was not correct or say I need to uh, do something for a client, I will edit the video and then go from there. But regardless, that's what I have normally on my phone. I typically have about 20 gigabytes of music on my phone as well. I got some space here with uh, YouTube, so on and so forth, all right? So that is something to consider. But like I was saying, back in the day, I could easily get away with 128 gigabytes, but now I easily sit at around 160. And say I was to like trim some of this stuff, some of this stuff off here, I could I could probably still get away with 128 gigabytes, but I would ha I'd be having to do more uh, like housekeeping on my phone. So that's something that you really t need to take into consideration, especially if you're into playing games on your on your iPhone and you're going to be getting your iPhone 16 Pro and uh, you plan to do a lot of gaming on that as well uh, that those the games can take up a lot of space and so on and so forth apps in general it can take up a lot of space and the cameras on these iPhones they've you know they've always been amazing but they've gotten even more amazing the video recording capability so if you're somebody who you know is going to be recording lots of videos uh not so much the photos photos aren't going to take up that much space but the videos if you know you're going to be doing a lot of video on your on your upcoming iphone 16 pro then uh they or your you know your new iphone in general then make sure you get at least 256 gigabytes that way you can enjoy your phone without having to constantly be worried about you know doing that house housekeeping right or you're on vacation and all of a sudden you're on you run out of space and you're over there just you know wasting valuable time you know uh, doing the housekeeping. But anyway, hopefully this video helps and uh, I'll catch all you later. Bye.